Welcome to our kitchen folks. Today I'm making a simple <laughs> Italian meal and some of you may have seen previous videos of me making this so we're going to refresh your memory by making it again. It's, Wendy doesn't like the word casserole. It's kind of like an Italian casserole but we shouldn't say casserole so yeah. I'm going to grab the camera in a minute or Wendy can grab it and by the way Wendy's making garlic bread. Yeah, I bought yeah. some uh, along, what do you call them baguette? Baguette, sourdough. Sourdough baguette, so she makes her own garlic bread oh, yeah. and she's cut up fresh garlic, organic garlic, and made a butter oil and parsley, butter, butter and olive oil. you spread it on there yum, yum. and you're going to bake them. So yeah. anyway, in this casserole here, or Italian dish, um, I have garlic diced up. The first layer I have a, a white or walla walla onion cut into pieces, and then I have a full zucchini uh, cut into discs. Over that, and on each layer, I grate fresh Parmesan cheese. I put uh, Italian herbs, which is oregano, and I put basil, and uh, and then, like I say, I grate the uh, Parmesan. And uh, I got basil leaves in here. And then uh, the next layer, the third layer, I have hot Italian sausage, which I've already cooked. I've already cooked on the um, on the stove in a pan, and uh, I put uh, I put garlic on that, and I put some. Um, some Parmesan cheese, and now I'm going to take Oop. this Oop. tomato sauce. See this? Show them, show them this here. We're cheating on show, the tomato take, sauce. Take a look at this. Down into here. Show We're that. Cheating. You see that, folks? Oh yeah. And there's lots of garlic it's in there so and fresh good. basil leaves. So then you take this, and you take that tomato sauce, and you drizzle yeah. it all over this. We're you, a little bit of cheating because usually we'll use a, a well a canned tomato sauce, but then add a, well you've added your own. This will work. Yeah, it's great. And then you bake this in the oven at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes. minutes. And I'm yeah, going to put some. I'm going to finish this off with Roma tomatoes on top. Yeah. This is going to be really good. It goes really good with garlic bread. It also goes goes good with a little glass of wine. And Joe put in um, this really nice. Um, I don't know if you can local see it. basil. Oops, fresh basil. Really nice. This stuff is great because what you do is you put it in a. Um, Here, he's hitting my arm. You put it in a little vase with water Chocolate. and it's, <laughs> to do this. just let me film this. It stays fresh. So it's great. It's really nice. So, so this is what I do. I smooth this out like that. So we got the tomato sauce in there. And then I'm going to take this. This makes it look real nice. Take some fresh Roma tomatoes, locally grown here on Salt Spring Island. Nice. This is going to be our dinner tonight. Not finished yet. Like that. Our friend gave us those. Yeah, one of the, the guys I work with. Garden. Yeah, he grows Romas. Nice. Not nice. Yeah. We, we didn't grow Romas this year. No. Next year. So now I'm going to go like this. Take a little bit of basil, a little bit more basil. Put it on top. And you already put the fresh. Inside. We've got lots of fresh basil and I even picked some of our own. A little bit of fresh basil there. And finish it off with some fresh Parmesan. Parmesan. This is a really easy meal. So remember 350 at, for about 45 minutes, huh? Something yeah, like that. It's great. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. It's simple. Anybody can make this. Yeah. I'm not a chef. I'm not even a great cook, I don't think. Sure you are. Oh yeah, you are. When do you think Sam? She's just saying that would be nice. No, I'm not. He is a good cook. So we, remember, each layer has some of this in it. So this is going to melt in, give it that flavor. I don't add any salt either because I think there's enough salt in that hot Italian sausage, which is all cut into discs there. Okay, mm. I got it on a pizza tray. There you go. And so that's what it looks like. And if we were going to put salt on afterwards, we use the pink, yeah, yeah. grate it on. So anyway, that's all, folks, going into the oven. And uh, okay. we're going to enjoy there that. You go. Let's open up the oven. Here's the oven. Thanks for watching. Oven's on. There it is. Radio. Oven's on. Going in. Going in. There, there it, it is. Goes. Thank you. That's all, folks. We're going to enjoy. So try that because you'll enjoy it too. Okay. I got to show them our little art gallery up above. Yeah, you do that. We have a really cool kitchen. I think we have a cool kitchen. We've got Joe's tiki's up there. We have lots of plants. We love plants. We are still doing some renos here. This is a reno, a wash. Uh, actually, I shouldn't start talking about all that. That's, <laughs> That's not nothing to do with cooking. <laughs> no, it's nothing not. to do with cooking at all. That'll be another video. Sorry. 
Bye. Bore these people to death. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Bye.